spare us your attention, Merlin. We will try to be as interesting as the view from the window. The window, unlike your maps, Lord Keller, looks out upon a world of borderless wonders. Despite your scorn, Merlin, man-made borders are nonetheless real. And the South Anglians are claiming that we are infringing on theirs. From the looks of this, it appears we are. Redraw the map. Move our border back. We will not trespass on South Anglia. Trespass? A great kingdom like Camelot does not trespass. It expands. I will handle this matter in my own way. Have you forgotten, Lord Keller, that with Arthur and Guinevere away, I am the voice of Camelot? Camelot will not acquire land by stealing it. Good day, Lord Keller. That idiot! Allowing Camelot to be dictated to by a second-rate power like South Anglia! Such passion, Lord Keller. What a pity you are not leading the negotiations. Indeed. If I had my way, the South Anglians would pay a steep price for their impertinence. That could be arranged. You mean Merlin could be removed? But Merlin has the king's ear. To accomplish erasure would take nothing less than a miracle. True. And what would the price of this miracle be? We can settle the account later. My dear Lady Morgana, I shall be forever in your debt. No, not forever. But long enough. Listen well, Lord Keller. The goblet with the boar's head upon its side contains a sleeping potion. This one with the owl is a harmless fruit punch. At the banquet, honoring the East Anglian ambassador tonight, all you need do is... Engage Merlin in conversation. My servant will then approach with the two goblets. Merely see to it that Merlin takes the one with the boar's head. Rowan, look. It's Morgana's lackey. That's odd. I've never before seen him serve anyone but Lady Morgana. Yes, it's very odd indeed. of a woman's care. I wouldn't be so ready to place Merlin in his grave just yet, Lady Morgana. Take care, Valiant, that two graves are not required. We have much to settle, Merlin. Our reckoning is long past due. And you, Lord Keller, how do you intend to deal with young Valiant? This is Aristotle. He takes care of certain unpleasant details for me. Morgana's knowledge of mixtures and potions is legendary. If we're to save Merlin, we'll need assistance from someone highly skilled in the alchemist's arts. Alchemy isn't the world's most common profession, Valiant. Where will we find such a person? Ha-ha! <laughs> we found him! According to this letter, he's been trained by Merlin himself. It's signed, Yours in Friendship, the Mighty Own. What kind of person calls himself the Mighty Own? We'll find out soon enough.
What place is this? A dream, my beloved. Lynette, how can this be? Where have you come from? From the longings of your heart, dear Merlin. This cannot be. It has happened, Merlin. The dream you thought you had lost has come true. We are together again. Lynette, my dear, dear Lynette. 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 Enjoy your sweet dreams. May they last forever. As soon as the hourglass has emptied itself, your fate will be sealed, my dear Merlin. I would gladly take that advice. What do you think it is? I don't know. But we can't let it keep us from finding Ohm. We have come in search of the mighty Ohm, and I warn you, we will allow nothing to stand in our way. Oh! needs the mighty Ohm's help. For Merlin, there is nothing I wouldn't do. You? You are the mighty Ohm? Well, not all of us can be Merlin, you know. Looks aren't everything. Intelligence counts for something. And intelligence, my young friend, I have in abundance. Let me think. Let me think. Just one swallow of this and Merlin immediately lost consciousness. Oh, dear, dear, dear. That sounds like one of Lady Morgana's sleeping potions. Terrible, terrible things. Is it deadly? No, 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 of course not. Well, not right away. Only if its effects are allowed to continue for more than 24 hours. Arn, what if we aren't able to get back to Merlin in time? Providing you with this antidote could prove dangerous. Lady Morgana can be a formidable enemy. I could be risking my very life. Yet, Merlin would do the same for me. And again, Merlin is Merlin. He is Morgana's equal. And better. Oh, Valiant, he's arguing with himself. And losing. Oh, dear, dear, dear. What is it? As I suspected, it is one of Morgana's sleeping potions. The problem is, I'm not sure I have the antidote for it. Lynette! Lynette! That's right, Merlin. Dream about how lovely your life could have been. Thirsty work, isn't it, my love? Are you happy, Merlin? Here with me? Completely. I've never felt more at peace. You left me once, Merlin. Promise never to leave me again. <gasps> Merlin? Merlin, what is it? Something beckoning me. Whatever it was, you must resist its call, Merlin. You must! I can't be certain, but this should serve to undo Morgana's mischief. <coughs> I apologize. <coughs> the taste and odor are a little less than pleasant. Yes, well, thank you for your efforts. Oh, I should warn you. I had to substitute some ingredients. I cannot guarantee the mixture's effectiveness. Oh, 
The mixture might be highly unstable. It could either cure Merlin or kill him. Valiant, how can we take such a risk? What are we gonna do? We'll have to determine the nature of this substance. Valiant, no! Rowan! It's all right. I'm fine. That was a stupid thing to do, Rowan. You could have... No! Oh, dear God. Please help her. Rowan! Rowan! Riot? Is she? Arn. Her heart is still beating. She's alive. This is going to be a long night. Is she gonna die? We won't know that until morning. Yes, Merlin, dream. Dream of your sweet Lynette. Do you like your breakfast? It, like everything your hand touches, is graced with sweetness and goodness. <gasps> Send it away, Merlin. Make it leave. No, Merlin, it'll destroy you. I sense no evil in it, Lynette. It deceives you. Merlin, please send it away. Grim Shadow, what do you want of me? Soon, very soon, I shall have won. I thought she would always be with me, Arn. Until my arm was too old to lift a sword and my eyes too dim to aim an arrow. She brought me warmth and caring. And those were her gifts to me, Arn. And I can't bear to lose them. She brought those gifts to me as well, Valiant. I don't have your words. I don't know how to speak about what is in my heart. But I know what I feel when I look at Rowan. I feel good. Strong. Could it be that I love her? Arthur is calling you, Merlin. Don't listen to him. He is calling you away from your true love. You left me once for this man. If you go again, you will never return to me. He offers you nothing but a cold, solitary life. He needs me. One day he will change the world, Lynette, and I must be there to help him. A strong will, Merlin, as do I. Let us end our little contest. Listen to my voice. Oh, don't leave me, Rowan. Without your laughter, my world will be silent. is where it ends, Merlin. Merlin. Merlin! Curse you! From this day forward, may you reap only despair! You never loved me. Your words were a deceit. And your heart was empty! No, Lynette. No, I have loved you. And I always will. 
Morgana! Oh, Valiant. I was so afraid. No more than I was. Rowan, there's something I must tell you. And will you speak for both of us, Valiant? Am I not to be included in these talks? Arn, you sound so, so serious. Is there something wrong between you and Arn? No, not really. Well, it's, it's just that if you had to choose, Rowan, between me or Valiant, which one would it be? Choose? Between my two best friends? Oh, Arn, it, it would be like asking me to break my heart in two. So, young lady, at last you are up and around. And I'm not a minute too soon. Hmm. Color good, eyes clear. How about the headache? Stomach ache? Gone. I'm sorry about all of that, but I couldn't be too careful now, could I? Merlin is a man with a great many enemies. You do understand, don't you? I had to be certain the three of you could be trusted. Merlin is very dear to me. I love him very much. I understand. We love him too. Bless you. That is the real antidote. You have my word on it. May it serve Merlin well. You are not the fool you pretend to be, Om. No. Like you, I understand the value of loyalty and friendship. Nothing. Nothing will prevent this antidote from getting to Merlin. You have my word on it, too. Godspeed, my friend. Godspeed. Ready, Arn? <laughs> yes. Arn, what is it? What's troubling you? Rowan, I... I... I'm <laughs> glad you're better. Arn! Wait! Look at the time. I will soon be rid of you. You will pay for this, Morgana! You cannot hurt me, Merlin. In this world of dreams, I am indestructible. And now, I will destroy you. You are mistaken, Morgana. <laughs> you failed with a wind. Do you care to try the earth? As you wish, Dark Lady! Forgive me, Merlin. I've broken you a little toy. Enter my chamber unannounced. If you will excuse me. Drink, Merlin. Drink. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You've 
been a worthy opponent all these years, Merlin. But now the game has ended. And I have won! See, I've arrived just in time. So, Merlin, you've won. How can that be? You're a clever woman, Morgana, but there is much you have yet to learn. Indeed. Indeed. You have yet to learn, Morgana, that there is no power on Earth greater than the power of love. True love, like true friendship, one of life's rarest and sweetest miracles. <laughs> <laughs> 